I felt like nobody cared whether I lived or died until your daughter stood up for me at school. Those were the words of a young man named Adam who attended Columbine High School with my daughter Rachel. Adam was a special needs student who was being shoved around by two bigger boys when Rachel intervened. After that incident, Rachel encouraged her friends to greet Adam in the school hallways with an encouraging word or a simple smile. No one knew that Adam was planning to commit suicide until Rachel changed all of that by simply showing that she cared. After her death at Columbine, Adam met with our family and told us the story of how she saved his life through a simple act of kindness. There are many lonely people out there that have hidden behind the walls of their self-made castles. A simple greeting or a smile or an appropriate touch is sometimes the catalyst that brings their drawbridge down and helps them connect with others. Words like arrows pierced my soul, meant to tear me down. Jokes and insults, snide remarks, flying all around. Hiding in my castle walls, feeling isolated, like a prisoner locked away, lonely and deflated. Texting, gossip, cyber pain, catapults I fear, flung from unexpected places when no one is near. So I raise my drawbridge up, high above the moat, while I'm striving deep inside to try and stay afloat. And then I see you once again, arriving at my castle, both of us with hurt and pain, so weary from life's hassle. So dare I open up again, and dare I venture out, and dare I let go of my pain, my fearfulness and doubt. I yearn to leave these walls of stone, but all of that depends on whether I can trust once more my family and my friends. So can you help me find the way that leads to stable ground? And dare I trust yet once again to let my drawbridge down? If you're hiding behind your castle walls, I want to encourage you to venture out. If you know others that have closed their windows, barred their doors, and raised their drawbridge, take the time this week to offer them a simple gesture of kindness. You never know when you may be saving a life.